All right, we're coming back here. Vance Keeney uh, alongside Big Chad. We're coming back from our intermission break. NWA Georgia Heavyweight Championship match is coming up here. We're going to throw to Jason Boyd, our ring announcer. He'll take care of the announcement. The following contest is your main event of the evening and is sanctioned by the National Wrestling Alliance and is for the NWA Georgia Heavyweight Championship. Keeney here with Big Chad Shepard joined here at ringside. NWA Georgia Heavyweight Championship is on the line tonight. J-Rod winning the Saturday Night Rumble back in December to win a shot here at the NWA Georgia Heavyweight Championship. And as, as, uh, as cashed in, I, I guess I can't really say cashed in, he's earned this title shot and he's, uh, he's taking on Tyson Dean here this evening. Senior referee Radar Martin here at ringside, or uh, here in the ring. We'll, uh, we'll be in charge of this NWA sanctioned match, as are all of our matches here this evening. J-Rod defeating, uh, he was the sixth person into the matchup, the Rumble match, and uh, ended up defeating, at the end of the match, Bill the Butcher and Payne. Pain, yeah. 
to uh, to finish off that match up here to win this title shot. A hard fought veteran uh, here in the southeast. Definitely across the state of Georgia, well known J Rod is in the state of Georgia, and uh, finally getting a chance at a national NWA title here is J Rod, and uh, taking on Tyson Dean here, the champion. See some amateur wrestling maneuvers here to start out the matchup as well. Front face lock from J Rod's got Tyson Dean down on the mat. Tyson with a reversal into an armbar. You know, Vance is going to be the battle of who who can out wrestle who, I believe. Absolutely, and of course. The X Factor outside the ring. Their manager, Kurt Kilgore, always has something. Tyson Dean into the ropes here, breaking the hold. Dean frustrated. Dean is frustrated here. Kurt Kilgore got his man prepared for this matchup. You certainly know that's happened. Absolutely. Referee Radar Martin trying to get the champ back into the ring here. Kilgore trying to take care of his man. Tyson Dean back up on the apron, heading into the ring here. Yeah. Kurt Kilgore yelling at J-Rod. J-Rod trying to get this matchup back going here. You know, I don't think I want to know what they're talking about. I really have no idea. They're pointing at each other's <laughs> groins, that's for sure. I'm not really sure what's happening. But... uh Hopefully we'll get back this into back into a wrestling matchup here. Going for the lockup. J Rod with a front kick. Missing Tyson Dean. Radar Martin knows that's legal. Nothing we can do about it. Tyson Dean amateur boxing background there as well. Going in. J Rod with a go behind. Got him in a, oh with a trip there. Front leg sweep. J Rod's got him down in the front face lock again. Going for the amateur wrestling maneuver as well. Absolutely. This is something we haven't seen from J-Rod or Tyson Dean in the recent months. Uh, but they're pulling out all the stops trying to get this matchup here. J-Rod trying to roll Tyson Dean over. It looks like may have some sort of a submission hold on him at this point. Before Tyson was actually training to be a wrestler, he was actually training in MMA, if I recall. That's true. Tyson trying to get up to a vertical base. He is on his knees. Got a nice struggle here on the mat for some type of a, of a hole there. Tyson, we have a pinfall attempt here. J-Rod with a leg scissors around the head of Tyson Dean. Tyson going for a pinfall, but neither shoulder down for Radar Martin to get more than one count here at this point. Both of these guys are seriously active in this matchup. Tyson on a mount there now. Not even trying for a pinfall attempt, but Radar Martin right on top of things. Great action here on the mat. The fans are certainly into this matchup as well. Tyson Dean with a front face lock seems to have the advantage at this point. Oh, leg takedown there from J-Rod. J-Rod with the reversal has got the leg hooked. Radar Martin ready for a pinball. Radar's been on the mat more than these guys have this <laughs> matchup. So. Well, testing his mat skills too. Absolutely. Radar Martin, a lot of people don't know, called the All Valley Karate Championships back in '84. Oh wow! The semifinals. So he has a certainly referee there. Tyson Dean frustrated with what's happening here in the ring as J Rod remains in the ring here. Tyson and J Rod matching amateur uh, skills here with each other. J Rod a little smirk on his face. He might know he got the best of Tyson Dean at this point. Absolutely. Kilgore talking to his man Tyson. Tyson back into the ring just in time to break the count. Radar Martin growing frustrated. He's worked every match here this evening, so he's got to be tired. Oh, yeah. He's going to be ready to go home. Starting that 10 count once again. Kilgore giving it to him here at the ringside. This is certainly not working to J-Rod's advantage at this point. Because yeah, the champ has to be in the ring to win the title. Yeah, you have to have a pinfall or submission from, uh, from Tyson Dean in order for J-Rod to become the champion, even a DQ or disqualification. As we've seen numerous times in the past, champions go for a DQ to get out of winning that title, but I don't think we're going to see that here tonight. J-Rod going for Dean, <laughs> scaring Dean off the apron there. Kurt Kilgore with his back to the ring, drawing with the fans. 
making friends there as always. Yeah, my, my granddaddy used to say, if you wouldn't be so mean, you wouldn't be so scared. Well, that's true. Tyson Dean back over to the steps. Climbing into the ring, got some instructions there for Radar, Mount, Radar Martin. I don't know. Kurt Kilgore seems to be a little bit hot. He is on edge, that's for sure. Crowd tonight. He is on edge, that's for sure. He doesn't want to see J-Rod. Oh. He is, uh, has seen J-Rod across the state of Georgia over the years. Powerful clotheslines. Tyson Dean outside the ring once again up against the barricades. J-Rod, a house of fire here with Tyson Dean. Dean kicking the, the ringside steps here. Growing constantly frustrated with J-Rod. Tyson Dean winning the uh, the title match uh, back in December against Andy Anderson. Underhanded ways, even though it was a no disqualification match. Tyson Dean was able to hit Andy Anderson with some type of a foreign object as Andy Anderson had him up for the uh, for the backbreaker submission maneuver. Uh, Andy Anderson was uh, knocked out, but uh, as you may or may not know, Big Chad, Andy Anderson had a torn tricep oh. as he went into that matchup. I, I, mean, I don't know the curtain or something. I don't I know. Tell, that, I don't know that Tyson Dean knew about that. Obviously, he didn't focus on it during the matchup. Here, Andy Anderson had a uh, had a hurt and a torn tricep, and Andy Anderson has had surgery to repair that torn triceps. But you have to understand that had to have some effect on what happened in that matchup, regardless of what happened to Tyson Dean and whatever he hit Andy Anderson in the head with to win the matchup. <laughs> Absolutely. And we hope that and we hope that uh, Andy has a speedy recovery from that and can get back in the ring. He has had successful surgery. Uh, I've uh, been in contact with Andy. He has had successful surgery, and uh, Tyson Dean and J Rod are in the ring now, forehead to forehead, comparing hairlines. Apparently, Tyson Dean turning his back to J Rod. Tyson Dean with a knee to the stomach there and a clubbing blow to the back of the shoulders of J Rod. Dean going for a throw. Belly to belly suplex there, another amateur maneuver. Tyson taunting J Rod at this point. I'm surprised to see these two men stay in the ring for introductions at this point because uh, they're certainly at each other at throat right now. Tyson, he pulling at the face of J Rod, the nose and the eyes. Got to keep an eye out for Kurt Kilgore, obviously at ringside. He knows his man's in charge of the match at this point. Tyson measuring J-Rod there. Almost a double pump on that last shot. Tyson with a boot to the throat of J-Rod. You can't even hear J-Rod scream. He can't even get air in to scream right th at this point. Tyson now choking J-Rod over the bottom rope. Radar Martin being distracted by Kurt Kilgore ringside. This is what Kilgore is paid to do. Yep. This is what he gets his 25% for. <laughs> is out there representing the champ. Kurt Kilgore now, I think, has managed the last three NWA heavyweight champions in NWA Atlanta. Whether it's the Georgia heavyweight title or the NWA Atlanta title. Uh, from Mike Cannon to Andy Anderson uh, in, uh, in the Night Enterprises. Uh, at that point, you know, he's managed all those champions, so he certainly has a, a nose for the gold, so to speak, right. and knows how to get his man the gold around his waist. That's right. Former tag team Andy Anderson and Axel Anderson, back when they were with uh, Night Enterprise, like you said. That's true. Tyson Knee lifting J-Rod up. Let's see. Oh, my gosh. Right over the barricade there. Oh, huge maneuver. Ringside there dropping J-Rod. His chest first over the barricade. J-Rod's gasping for breath. We can hear him here at ringside. Dean with some shots to the back. J-Rod pushing him into the barricade there. Going back and forth here at ringside. These fans getting front row seats are absolutely getting their money's worth tonight. Oh, huge chop from Tyson Dean here at ringside. J-Rod coming back and fighting him out. Fighting him out of that corner. J-Rod, you're not going to get past a veteran like this. You don't take him to ringside. That's right. As long as Tyson Dean's been around NW Atlanta, J-Rod's been throughout the Southeast now for at least a decade, maybe longer. He knows his way 
inside the square circle and outside. Kirk Kilgore going at ringside there. Don't know what he did to J-Rod as he passed by. He ran at J-Rod. Dean with an axe handle right off the, right off the apron under the shoulder blades. Right into the barricade there, J-Rod once again. See if we can get that back into our camera angle. Radar Martin trying to get these fellas back into the ring here to finish up this matchup. But Tyson Dean knows as long as this stays outside the ring, he's not going to lose his title. some issues here with our camera angle. We're going to try to get it fixed up here. We need to see what we can do with that. See what we can do to get the camera angle right. j Raw with a huge elbow over this hop rope. This may be all. It may, have, it may have hurt that elbow on the outside. Absolutely. He hit that elbow there. That's a huge elbow there. He should have won that matchup. Should have gotten a three count out of that. We're going to see there. I'm going to hand it over to Chad so I can fix the camera angle here. These men are just groaning in pain. Radar Martin over there checking them out. What a huge opportunity. Looks like they both took a toll on the outside here. Big shots from Tyson Dean on J-Rod. Choke him in in the corner. All right. Big Chad, thanks for holding that down for me here. We got... Uh, Shot or ring back in the shot here. Hopefully we can keep these guys off the barricades and back in the ring where this match where this match belongs. Anytime you have chaos like this, you don't know what's going to happen here at ringside. And we apologize for but it's Kirk Kilgore right there with a shot to J Rod. Referee Ray Armand with his attention to Tyson Dean did not see that. Shut up, J Rod going after Kirk Kilgore here at ringside. Tyson Dean right from behind there. Kirk Kilgore providing the distraction. Exactly what he needed to get up, to get Tyson Dean back into the uh, back into control here. Another shot at ringside right into the barricades. Radar Martin's got to get this back into the ring. I tell you what, Vance, these these steel rails have not been friendly to anybody here tonight. <laughs> Number one, it's bad enough that they're steel, yeah. but it's about 45 degrees in this building. And uh, I'm sure that they're cold and hard. You hear cold, hard steel all the time. That is certainly exactly what it is. J-Rod with a shot to the chest of Tyson Dean. Another clubbing blow. Oh, Tyson Dean with a chop of his own. These guys are trading chops here at ringside. Boot to the stomach. J-Rod's head right into the ring apron. Another shot there. Kurt Kilgore. Smiling here at ringside. Absolutely pleased with what's going on with his man. Tyson Dean in control of this matchup. Once again, going for a cover. A two count there from Tyson Dean. Rear chin lock there on J-Rod. Tyson Dean has it applied right in the center of the ring. J-Rod cannot make it to the ropes to break that hold. Let's see what he comes up with here to possibly get out of this. It is a submission type maneuver. May actually see him get knocked out here as well. Two. Radar Martin with oh, Radar Martin dropped over the three. J-Rod got that right arm up just wow. as his left arm was going down. J-Rod up here. Oh, he's got Tyson Dean's head around top of his head. Oh. Face buster, chin buster there from J-Rod. Got that whole book in there. J-Rod with a, a a kick right to the to the uh, thighs there of Tyson Dean. Head of steam from J-Rod. Knee to the face of Tyson Dean right to the side of the head in the temple. Neck breaker set up there. Tyson works out of it. J-Rod into the corner somewhat. Back elbow for Tyson Dean. He had his eyes right on Dean as he was coming in. J-Rod another knee to the, knee to the face. Neck breaker there. Let's see if J-Rod's got enough to get this pinball. 
Kurt Kilgore pulling Radar Martin out of the ring. J-Rod didn't even have the leg hooked. If he hooked the leg, he might have gotten a three count. Radar Martin has about had it with Kurt Kilgore, and so is J-Rod. J-Rod with Kilgore's hair. He's got his ponytail. J-Rod got Kilgore's ponytail. Shot right in the head of Kilgore. That's the best thing I've seen all night. Absolutely. Tyson (laughs) knee with a boot to the midsection to J-Rod. J-Rod with a knee lift there. Got to get picking up Tyson. Looks like he may be going for some type of a slam there. Radar Martin. Tyson Dean grabbing Radar Martin. Dean grabs Radar. Radar's into the corner there. Dean was holding on to him. J-Rod with a back elbow, but Radar Martin is down. Face buster there. This could be all. J-Rod, if he could get the cover, this might be a three count here. J-Rod's knocked out. The BFFs have made their way to ringside. They're attacking a ring announcer. What are they doing here? I have no idea. BFFs have dropped their title belts at ringside. They're out here. J-Rod looks up. He saw a big shadow in the ring. Anthony Andrews is up on the apron. J-Rod distracted. Michael Stevens sliding a chair into Tyson Dean. J-Rod booting the stomach of Tyson Dean. Tyson sets him up. Oh! Face plant right into the chair. Tyson Dean throws the chair out of the ring. Kurt Kilgore was knocked out. He's back up vertical. Michael Stevens trying to get Radar Martin woken up. Kilgore's in the ring with Martin. Two. Martin with a two count there. One, two, three. What in the world? What on earth are the BFFs doing here? I don't know what's happening here. Kirk Kilgore has asked for a microphone. The PFS and Tyson Neen are absolutely destroying J-Rod. Security's getting into the ring here. These guys are clearing house of security. But what the heck is going on here? Security's outside of the ring. The PFS have gotten rid of security. Tyson Dean, the PFS, Kirk Kilgore in the ring now. Tyson Dean destroying J-Rod with the chair. Tyson Dean got the arm bar there. Oh my gosh, he's got a Kimura on J-Rod. We talked about his MMA experience here. He might be breaking J-Rod's arm. J-Rod's tapping out here. He may have broken J-Rod's arm. Here comes Marco. Marco's in the ring. We saw Marco and Fried Eddie earlier. Here comes Fried Eddie. He's hitting the ring as well. Marco taking the beat down. Fried Eddie and Tyson Dean, certainly no strangers. Fried Eddie and the BFS. And Marco had their match earlier tonight. Friday and Marco hit the ring. And these three men are taking care of business. The BFS said that they wanted to be taken more seriously here. Let's listen to what Kirk Kilgore has to say. Look at the chaos. It's like three hours into that movie, going with the wind. You got so many people spread out. Now, if you don't mind, Jay Rod. And company, Kurt Kilgore's got something he'd like to say. Last week, two weeks ago in the starting ring, Kurt Kilgore made a mistake. He was the beginning of the year. I represent the World Heavyweight Champion, and I thought it would be fun to take my shirt off and give all of you people a show. Where I sit now, I made a photo walk. I made a full ball trying to have fun. Absolutely despicable. Get her out of here, Lurch. See this right here? Let me show you something. All this color, all this fun, all this happiness, that's no more. Last week you humiliated me and the tramp. When there's no more fun times, there's no more color because this doesn't represent real men anymore. 
real men used to be someone to look up to, someone to respect, someone that would smoke a cigar when the match was over. That was the tradition of professional wrestling. Yet throw your trash if you want, because that represents you. As I was saying, that was the tradition of professional wrestling. All you people used to watch it with your tracking on your VHS tape. But you know what? I'm bringing tradition back. This is tradition. Try to throw my addiction, I'll relapse. They call me 